comes to manicures, splurging on yourself is something some people want to do. Gel has exploded, though, in popularity because it lasts so long. But it's not necessarily good for your nails, not to mention the UV light they use to dry the polish could cause skin cancer. Well, our Christy Post is here with a new, healthier nail trend that I didn't even believe when she told me about it. Well, we both love getting manicures, especially with the polish that lasts a lot longer. Yes. Well, let's look at both of our nails. Preston, if you can come in. They both look the same. They're they both do. the same color, but there's one major difference. Mine is safer and healthier. And right now, this product that I have on my nails is hitting salons in Tampa Bay. On Davis Islands, word of mouth travels fast. We're doing a light pink. Customers at TNL Nails are finding out about a new nail trend called dip powder. We'll suggest it if we see that, you know, they've tried the gels, it's starting to weaken their nails. Owner Mai Ven says unlike gel, the powder doesn't use a UV light and won't damage your nail bed. It also doesn't smell, feels lightweight, dries fast, and lasts up to two weeks. It takes about three layers to get the true color. By dipping your nails in the acrylic, it creates a hard surface that allows your nails to grow underneath. The dip works out much better for me because my nails have gotten very brittle and they've also started breaking in places they never did before. Whether you like sparkles or a natural looking nail, there are 65 colors to choose from. The downside, though, is you have to file or drill your nail before it's finished. And if you're not careful, the acrylic can crack. As for getting the powder on your toes, there will be no dipping. They really enjoyed it. But despite those downfalls, Venn's clients say it's a manicure with a lot of upsides. And from here, they expect the popularity to grow. Yeah, I've been very happy with it. I've been very happy with it. The cost is about $10 more than a regular gel manicure. And to take it off, it's just like the gel. You need to use acetone, and it takes a while. So that's another downfall. But happy manicures, ladies.